The Bank of England is examining claims that the high street lender Metrobank put customers' data at risk by allegedly misusing software at the center of a long-running legal dispute. Last month the central bank's whistleblowing team was contacted by a person raising concerns about the integrity and security of software used to connect Metrobank's in-branch coin counters, known as magic money machines, to customer accounts. The communications, seen by The Guardian, claimed that the original Magic Money Machine software was not made to be used on an online banking system but had been built out by the bank in a way that allowed cash to be deposited directly into customer accounts, potentially creating weaknesses in the system. The whistleblower also claimed that the source code for the machines may have been shared by Metro with other parties in a way that left customer accounts susceptible to compromise, suggesting that cash could be accessed by potential hackers and bad actors. Together, those issues potentially presented a significant security risk to Metrobank UK's network, the email said. The whistleblowing team in the Bank of England is now reviewing the allegations and has shared the communications with the city watchdog, the Financial Conduct Authority. The bank and the FCA declined to comment. Metrobank did not directly respond to the allegations. Metrobank, which has about 2.7 million customers and 76 branches, has not reported any incidents or complaints of security and data breaches to date. The lender has been in a long-running legal dispute regarding its coin counting machines, which are primarily designed to allow children to add up small change and which feature lively animations, including of its mascot, Metroman. A U.S. company, Arkeo, provided the software to Metro for six years and claims that the lender later leaked its source code to a rival firm. It has been pursuing Metro through U.S. courts since 2017 and filed a fresh lawsuit in the U.K. in 2022 in an attempt to sue the bank for £24 million. Arkeo claims that the lender infringed its copyright and misappropriated trade secrets relating to money-counting machines. High court documents outline how Metro and Arkeo worked together between 2010 and 2016 and how the relationship broke down over the following year. Arkeo claims Metro then instructed a Chicago-based company called Segetza to reverse-engineer and copy Arkeo's software. Segetza has denied wrongdoing. Metro said it could not comment on ongoing legal proceedings, but it addressed the case in its latest annual report. We believe Arkeo LLC's claims are without merit and are vigorously defending the claim, it said.